Caitlin were at one of the bars tonight and we went up to a group of girls and started telling them about the party, asking if they wanted to come. And um, this one lady, she was like, okay, what time does the party end? Because um, then I want to come back and get a customer. And I like kind of looked at Caitlin, like kind of distressed, like, oh man, like that's not the point. Like we want you to not have to work tonight. So I kind of like said to Caitlin, I don't want to take this lady like, we need to just, it's a waste of time, we need to just maybe get someone else. Um, but we ended up taking her with us, and um, tonight, at the end of the drama, she had tears in her eyes. So I went up to her and I talked to her, asked her what was going on, and she was like, I think I believe, but I don't know if I'm ready. So tonight she prayed the prayer of salvation with me for the very first time, and whenever she got done praying and she opened her eyes, there was just so much light in her eyes, and she looked like a totally different person. And apparently she's someone that this ministry that we work with, a uh, restoration home, that they have been working with her for a while and visiting her for a while, and she hasn't been ready yet to receive Jesus, but tonight she did, and so um, she has a phone number of the ministry here that she can get hooked up with and get a different job that she can get out of that lifestyle. We ended the night with bondage, um, like such a powerful drama. Uh, one of the teams performed it, and at the end, Kelly gave an altar call and I got to share a little bit afterwards about um, what Jesus did for us and how he came and took the chains of bondage off of our life and how God sent his son Jesus to pay the ultimate price for us so that we don't have to go through bond we don't have to live in bondage anymore, that we don't have to go through the things that the world offers us, that we can live in freedom and have peace and joy. So we had a time of um, worship and prayer here with the ladies in the room. Tonight was just such an awesome success and that um, it's going to be one that we will always remember and that I know that all of the girls who came here tonight will always remember.